Automatic reinforcement, folks. I can't think of a better example. <laughs> um, there's also this one. Oh, I, my last name is Sane, and Sanes pick their noses. It must be a sort of automatically reinforcing thing. It's uh, when the behavior that you're engaging in produces reinforcers as the result of engaging in the behavior that are not like delivered from an outside source that maybe it's sensory, maybe it just feels good. Oh, like rubbing my head, that just feels great. Automatically reinforcing. I could just do that all day. The only reason I stopped doing this is because it's socially inappropriate and I get punished if I do this all day long. Oh, or stop. All right. Anyway, so automatically reinforcing things is just that when the behavior itself produces the reinforcer. Um, oftentimes, nicotine produces a, an automatic reinforcement sort of scenario. People go, well, just, just well, you can extinguish cigarette smoking. Really? How? How are you going to extinguish the delivery of nicotine through the sick? It, it, it doesn't make sense. It's automatically reinforcing, right? Same thing with most drugs. They produce automatic reinforcement. So you have to work on different aspects of the behavior. So automatic reinforcement, the behavior produces the reinforcer. 